Hey, it says what? Thanks for stopping by my channel. So I wanted to give a shout out to my Dooney and Burke Art Deco Zip Zip Satchel. I love this thing. I've used it so much since I got it a few months ago. I can't stress enough how great a bag it is. And I keep it out, I keep it handy because I seem to move back into it whenever it's sunny out. Um, if it rains, I might move into a different bag for a while, but then I move right back into this one. I love that pattern so much. But the bag I'm carrying today is a different one. It's my Duty and Burke Oberland leather large satchel in the color white. The dimensions are very similar to the Duty and Burke Florentine leather large satchel. But this one I measured as 15 inches across, eight inches deep, 10 inches high, all the way up to here, although it does slouch down lower than that, and a handle drop of four to five inches, depending on how much of a slouch there is. And it does have a shoulder strap but um, I'm not using that. It's inside the bag. This Oberland leather is so soft and lightweight. You can see the bag almost folds up on itself. It has this beautiful Sierra brown leather trim, the buckles, and the tassels. I have an extra carabiner on there that I just use a portion of the strap if I want a short shoulder strap. And then it has the whip stitched handles. I don't know, I just felt like carrying this white bag. It's early June as I'm recording this and just felt like it. And I'm not carrying much in it, but um, I thought my hydrangea accessories would look really cute with it. Um, especially the ones that have some white in them. This Continental Wallet doesn't have much white, but if you squint, it sort of matches. Then I just have my change and um, my glasses case, sunglasses case. So that's it. Just a quick, uh, lost my train of thought. Just a quick video on my bag of the day. So thanks for watching everyone. I really appreciate it. Take care.